How to run a deep scan with Data Rescue 4. Let's go ahead and click Start New Scan. After selecting Start a New Scan, you will be shown all the drives connected to your computer. When running a deep scan, you will want to select the whole drive and not the partitions. A way to tell if you're selecting the whole drive is that it will generally have the manufacturer's name in the title and an arrow next to it, along with it not being indented. Go ahead and select the entire drive that you wish to scan and click Next. In this step, you will want to select the type of scan you are running and some information about the scan will be presented. Go ahead and select Deep Scan and click Start. Once you start the scan, a progress bar with the estimated time remaining will be shown at the bottom. This time will increase if the drive has physical problems, but will decrease once it passed those problem areas. Let the scan run until it completes. If absolutely necessary, you can choose to cancel, suspend, or end the scan early. However, we don't recommend doing so. Once the scan is completed, you will be shown two folders, the Found Files folder and the Reconstructed Files folder. This is where your recoverable data can be previewed before you choose to recover it. You will want to navigate around and see what files were recoverable at this point. Once you have decided which files you want to recover, go ahead and mark the checks box next to them and click the Recover button in the lower right corner. A new window will pop up where you can choose the location to save the recovered files to. You can save them directly to a folder or drive or choose to make a new folder. You have completed your scan and recovered your data. Now it's up to you to sort and search through it.